Get to some breaking news overnight. A DC United player is accused of using a racial slur against an opponent at last night's match. This is according to our reporting partner or our partners at the Washington Post. DC United was playing Inter Miami at home on Audi Field. And our Jess Arnold joins us now with the details. And uh, Jess, what do we know at this point? Well, as of this morning, we're hearing that that player is Taxi Funtas, according to the Washington Post, that he allegedly used a racial slur against a black player on Inter Miami's team last night, causing him to be pulled from the rest of the game. Now, our colleague John Henry was actually at that game last night. He said that play was stopped for about five minutes for that initial investigation. But Miami's Miami's team coach actually talked about this incident last night after the game. I told them that we were going to stick together, deal with this. Uh, that it was unacceptable, that there's no forms, there's no uh, place for racism for me in society, never mind on a football field. And uh, and and I think the situation and, and was handled really well under difficult circumstances. Now, he went on to say how proud he was of his players for how they handled the situation. He also said that, unfortunately, his team has dealt with racism before when playing in certain countries. Now, Neville also called DC United coach Wayne Rooney a class act in how he responded to the allegation in the moment. Now, a spokesperson for DC United said that they are aware of the allegations and are cooperating with the investigation. Major League Soccer sent us a statement that says, in part, MLS has zero tolerance for abusive and offensive language, and we take these allegations very seriously. They said they're investigating and they'll provide provide some more information after they do investigate. Now, a player from Miami also addressed the allegation last night. Sometimes you have to go through adversity to realize how much you truly love each other. Um, so, you know, with these guys um, and the way kind of everybody banded together, you know, you could really tell that we generally are a family. Uh, we generally do care about each other. And at the end of the day, um, I think we'll be stronger from this. Now, we still have to hear from Funta, so we'll be looking out for that, as well as keep an eye on when there are any updates in this investigation. We'll, of course, pass that info along to you. Now, DC United went on to lose that game by one goal last night, and they are off this upcoming weekend. Allison. Jess Arnold, thank you so much for that.